higher is the tax to utility ownership. What that does is it forms an artificial boundary that expands the homes of this religious community. On their holy days, there are things they're not allowed to do outside of their home. With this wire up, it expands the space of their home, and they can do it outside. Things like pushing a baby carrier or carrying a set of keys. We believe the expansion of this religious space is actually the expansion of our personal space. So if your house is in that space, you're now in this religious space. If our park is in that space, the park is now in this space. If there's a store in that space, store it. What else is going on besides this installation? Over the past week or so, it has been determined that out-of-state groups are busing and training in large groups of children to use our parks, those of Ramsey, Upper South River, and Montana. We have photographic evidence that will show you. Well, there too. No, no, these are the ones I have. Okay. Um, we believe that, and in order to the past, that the park should be for in-state residents only. Last but not least, there have been reports of unsolicited knocking on people's doors in the neighborhoods, which from people asking to buy their homes for cash. What have the town council officials done so far? So, so far on Friday, an announcement was made by the town of Sorry, I'm not going to do that, sorry. To remove the arrows as of, as, of, as of Friday. They have until August 4th to comply. The assumption is if they don't comply, there'll be some kind of penalty. Second, um, within the past month, they passed an ordinance limiting parks to only New Jersey residents. There are other ordinances being not in the process of being made, including the more stronger no not ordinance, and other things that the legal team is working on. The biggest question is what can you guys do? The most important thing I can, I can stress is stay calm. <laughs> all the process. Stay calm. Stay calm. <laughs> process. People aren't going to move into our neighborhoods tomorrow. We have to be aware of what's going on. Stay aware. And that's the second point. Educate yourself. Read articles about what's going on in Lakewood and in Rockland County and in Jackson and in Tom's River. It's going on now in other parts of the state. Be aware. So you're, you're informed and you're educated. Third, get involved. The five people in this group, we know, we know way less than what we know. There are lots of skill sets in this town. A lot of really, really smart people and a lot of dedicated people. Get involved. Besides just posting on the Facebook page. Volunteer. We're going to have more meetings and more meetings and more meetings. Please get involved. Give us your expertise. Last but not least, enforce the law. If you see somebody or even people in a, in a park town, call Mama Police. Their job is to respond to them. Don't dial 911. Call the the non-emergency police line. If you see one in your neighborhood knocking on doors, soliciting to buy homes, call the police. What shouldn't you do? Please, 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 if you are on the website or anywhere, do not do hate speech or disparaging the The other group is watching us. They are watching us like hawks. They are taking screenshots. They are aware of everything we said. They're here now, I'm sure. And I'm not against you being here. You're welcome here. You're welcome here. Please, understand that. Please be aware of what you said. Don't be hateful. People are people. We don't, we do not, not want the people doing our hands. We want them following the law. That's what we want. We're not, we're not against anyone. I want to make sure that's really clear. Not only to leave the room and tell all your friends, we're not against anyone. I want you to tell your friends. We are not against you. Yeah. <laughs> that, the last thing I want to say is, please do not have a posse and ballot. Do not solve these problems yourselves. If you see people in parks, don't confront them. If you see people knocking on doors, don't confront them. Leave it to the law enforcement officials. There were so many comments I saw on the website that I had to delete about people saying, I'm going to go out and remove these myself. Do not do that. That doesn't help us at all. In fact, it makes us look terrible. So please, let us be the, the higher ground in the state in compliance with the laws of the state, the town, and the country. Thank you very much. I appreciate you guys' attention.